and UD Snow, it's chaos, and we're getting it, 35 game win streak, that's a 35 game win streak, looking for 36, over 19,000 BC, looking for win number 40, for our online quick match fight, DeAndre Quartermaster, <laughs> fuck him, watch him pick the Cavs or the Warriors, he's gonna pick the Cavs or the Warriors, watch, Yo, pick a real team. Yo, beat the 76ers or the Jazz or the Lakers. We want the Magic or the Nets. That's who we really want is the Pelicans or the Pacers. We want the Suns or the Celtics. <laughs> Yo, at least pick a light jersey because that shit is too confusing. Good time, man. What do you got to work with over there? Let's see. Okay, no doubt, let's get it. <laughs> He's gonna be the type to quit because he can't stick with one team. That's okay, roll with the Knicks. <laughs> Fuck them. You're about to be win number 36 in a row, bro. We got that 35 game win streak, and this is about to be 36. 36? You're about to be number 36 in a row? <laughs> That's right. You're about to be win number 36 in a row on YouTube right now. Everyone's in shots. Everyone's hitting a shot. <laughs> uh, fuck them. <clears throat> All right, guys. Come on, let's get it. Looking for win number 36 in a row here. Come on, let's get it. We'll see if this guy rode the short bus with the shiny, hun with the shiny helmet and the chin strap coming down the hillside. <laughs> fuck them. Uh, okay. Okay. okay, 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 David, then it's Anthony, and it's Brzingis, and it's the four shots, and for San Antonio, Green teams with Leonard on the wings, Pau Gasol is out there with LaMarcus Aldridge, and it's Parker, and at the point guard position, Noah, the pass to Brzingis, Rose goes in, hell no, get the shit out, bro, Noah's shot is off, Last outing for San Antonio, it was a loss to Golden State. And, and hard to say whether it was the game plan defensively that let them down. Yo, what's with your leg? You got some shitty connection, bro. Or just the inability to really bring the fire on that side of the ball. And guys, it was a bit befuddling to me as to why they stuck with it. I mean, they dug themselves a hole and couldn't find the tweaks they needed to get out of. The San Antonio Spurs able to put the first points up on the board. Outside Rose. He kicks it to Carmelo. Here's the three. Yes, and it's Rose with the assist that time. Anthony's got himself going with the triple, his first basket of the game. A moment to check in with Doris Burke. Doris? I was able to talk with Jeff Hornacek for a moment. Come on, Jamarcus Russell. Meetings of the season, but coach feels he might have found an area for them to exploit. He said if we can be efficient in how we rotate on defense, we can close up some lanes and keep them from matching their scoring from before. We'll know soon enough if that's the case, guys. Thanks, Doris. So defense, it looks like, coming first for them today. That's their identity. That's what they're all about. Their defense is really what sparks them. And that has to be their spark if they're going to be successful. I mean, everything for them starts at the defensive end of the floor. Ah! Now here's Noah, the fast break opportunity. And the foul called on Daniel Green. Oh, Johnny Bearton. That's his first foul. First Here's Anthony, throws it down as the official calls the foul. It may be a three-point play. Carmelo? Paul Gasol. 
And guys, this game won't be close for long if they keep giving up dunks like that. No, it won't, G.A. You're right. A glaring error defensively and letting him get all the way to the basket that time. But it's only two points. I mean, it was flashy, no doubt. But still, it only counts for two. Two is all. Now here's Anthony. A 17-point game for him in the win against Philadelphia. And Rose throws it down. And how about a little bit of showmanship there as he increases the lead? Oh, I like that. That's got to be, though, a tough pill for the defense to swallow. Well, he's a guy that you know can hurt you with his passing. And right there, he does some damage with his finishing, too. And doing a great job here just stringing together solid possessions as they build that lead up. I tell you, there's no substitute for consistency, Greg. You know that. I know it. You can stay in control of the game. They'll stay in control of it if they simply stay good with their execution of the game plan and don't waste any possessions. For <laughs> <laughs> Well, they recover it. Noah drives in. Rose. Here's Persingas. It's good. This time the assist from Rose. Rose has got three assists tonight. Just look at what a sniper he is from long range. He's got such an unusual skill for a big fella. Now here's Parker. He puts up decent numbers on a nightly basis, averaging about 10 points a game. And Steve, near the bucket, he's one of the best finishers around. I mean, he does a great job of using his strong body to fight through contact and get to the rack. And so LaMarcus Aldridge nails them both. He's a dead eye at the line, fellas. Just call him automatic. He doesn't miss many of those. Anthony kicks to Rose. Lee outside. Into Noah. And he goes strong with the one-handed jam. And very little fight put up by the defense as he made his way to the bucket for the jam. They did seem to take the cautious approach, Greg, when it came to defending that one. You're right. And, guys, it's not the time for caution now. I mean, they've got to yeah. be aggressive take some risk to see if they can cut that lead down. The Knicks making a switch here. Anthony with it. Leonard picks him up. Anthony kicks to Thomas. Latrey. No good. So the Spurs will take it the other way. They're looking for a little bit of redemption in this one after the loss to them. Yeah. The last time. Presents a defender with a serious challenge. Always. Mills is checked in for Tony Parker. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for New York. They've been making some really nice passes out there. Excellent passing. That could set the tone for the rest of the game. And also, it's been a positive to watch that they've attacked the paint offensively as well. It's really been about the balance that they've shown. Rebounding is going to be the focal point for them in this one, fellas. I can feel it. No, it always is, and it has been so far, and they've gotten a nice edge on the glass. Now here's Janelle. And uh, right now he's averaging about seven points a game. In low to lead. And so far, having trouble converting on the inside. Yeah, those are the shots you want but they've been trickling out on them, guys. They've just got to stay with it. Persist in getting those good shots inside, and they'll drop. And that kind of defense ain't going to get it done. Gee, we don't see those kinds of dunks out of him all the time, but we know he's got it in him. There's no doubt about that, fellas. I mean, the more finishes like that he gets, the more his confidence will grow. You know what, guys? He can really light it up from the perimeter at times. And there's the pass to Kuzminskis. It's back to Jennings. New York moving it around. No good on the three. Well, they're fortunate. The defense was taking a big chance leaving him that wide open behind the arc. Easy to see who's going to win that race. Yeah, early offense is often easy offense. Excellent work that time. Now here's Jennings. Hasn't scored yet. That I'm sure will change. Pass to Thomas. There's the dish to Holiday. Jennings. Shot clock at six. No good with the triple. 
Now the feed to Ginobili. Passes it to Bertans. Kicks it out to Leonard. And San Antonio calls the first time out of the game. I think he just sees some things that can be improved and wants to Oh, get Johnny Burton and Tommy Burton and Rudy and Teddy and Ronnie and Reggie Gobert. I mean, if there's something that he's noticed that can give his team a lift, um, I think he's got to try to take advantage of that. Jamarcus's balls drip on your face, bruh. The Knicks making a switch here. We've got 13 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Now, Parker. There's Green with the three. He got it up that time, but it was Daniel. So at the end of one. And welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. More action in store as the players get ready to go. Having a nice break to get hydrated with Gatorade. And looking at what we've seen from the Knicks so far, what do you guys think? Damn well, they came out with, with the purpose of playing for one another, making the extra pass throughout that first quarter. Guys, that is simply just good basketball. I mean, really good basketball. Total team effort out there. And now let's check out the lineups courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. Here's the second quarter of play on the court for San Antonio. Parker and Danny Green are your one and your two. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. Then it's Pau Gasol. And it's Bertinus in at the four spot. And here is Green following the three-pointer by Carmelo Anthony. Green dishes to Gasol. And he's got his first free throw of the game. And he makes the first. The Knicks making a switch here. O'Quinn's checked in. Both free throws good from Gasol. New York leading by four. And out of bounds as the Spurs gain possession. A spare. Let's take this chance to showcase the top setup man at the small forward position in the NBA. Fifth best, Kawhi Leonard. And these are some of the best teammates you're ever going to want. Very unselfish players at a position where you don't Come on, see Tony. a lot of offensive facilitating. Yeah, you know, these guys are really more than capable of going it alone if the situation calls for it. But they'd much prefer to have everybody involved in the offense, and they go out of their way to try to make that happen. Again, the miss by the Spurs. And the foul called on Kawhi Leonard. Simmons. That's his first foul. San Antonio making a switch here. Simmons is checked in. And it's Lee penetrating. San Antonio with the rebound. Gasol's got three rebounds so far in the game. Virginis. Oh, come on, Johnny. No good from outside. <laughs> the Spurs gain possession. Let's take a moment now, Kevin, to see how the Spurs are doing in the NBA statisticals currently. First in three-point shooting. Second in block. And they are in the top ten in field goal percentage. Come on, this Simmons. Is a team get the that shows rebound. Discipline at the offensive end. And you look at their incredible... Are uh, you fucking idiot? What are you doing? I mean, it's not just about their accuracy, but their execution using springs and creating those open looks. That's been key. Anthony, Anthony. LaMarcus Aldridge is checked in for San Antonio. Anthony, the pass to Persingas. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Come on, man. And it's out of bounds. The Knicks will take it the other way. As we close in on the start of the playoffs, let's see how the West is stacking up. Taking a look at Golden State. And, of course, San Antonio. They're tied right now. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. You know what? They just are in a funk right now offensively. A good time to maybe come and come up with a play to get them a good look. Well, most coaches, you know, usually have a, a go-to speech or tactic that they can um, use when they need it most. So we'll see if that's the case here. Kawhi Leonard, he's checked in for San Antonio. The Knicks leading by four. 
Anthony with it. He's got nine. Leonard with the steal. And oh, here we go with Leonard. Oh, oh, oh. Yes. I don't know that this is the time for that kind of flair. In the close game, the important thing is the two points, not the dramatic. Oh, come on. Clark, he had to go for it, didn't he? Yeah, Perhaps. But, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> He's an athlete. And I, I can't fault it for that one, although it existed, I might have. Here's Green. Parker outside. Yo, what the fuck is with this lag? Come on, the And it's good on the assist by Parker. He's got six. Love the assist. I mean, he knew exactly where that bounce pass had to be to create that opportunity. And good. Got the English that time as it falls. So for New York, their last game, a win against the 76ers. And the way they attacked the basket in that game was unreal. I mean, after a while, the defenders seemed to just wave the white flag. Yeah, like you said, I mean, that's what will happen when a team continues Fucking to attack lag. the basket and come away with layups. The defense tends to get demoralized and deflated. Now, here's O'Quinn. Quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. Left side, Leonard. Left side, Leonard. The pass to Bears. No good. That would have tied it. Come on, Johnny. Leading by three. Throws with the ball. He's picked up by Parker. And it's out of bounds to New York. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> fuck. On purpose. He was nervous. And he was friends with Jerry. <laughs> fuck. To Persingas. Back to Anthony. Passes to Persingas. Clock at four. Lee. The three from Anthony. It's hauled in by Lamarcus Aldridge. Just not there from a rhythm standpoint right now. It's really eluding him. Let's it go with a three. The Spurs rebound. New York's gone one of four from three-point range in the second. Not a whole lot dropping out there for them. And, folks, he does more than just put two points onto their lead. He does it with a little bit of flair. Uh -huh, he sure does. You're right. It's a dazzling move to the bucket for him. I'll tell you what. He may not be the biggest man in the league, guys, but he more than makes up for that lack of size with amazing aerial skills. Now Rose after LaMarcus Aldridge's three-pointer that didn't go. New York moving the ball around. In transition, here come the Spurs. Parker leading the charge. He passes to Aldridge. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Parker. And the Knicks decide to take their first time out here. Quick review at the numbers for Kawhi Leonard. Sixth in steals, ninth in scoring, and tremendous confidence and consistency at the foul line. He ranks among the top 15 in free throw percentage. And talk about highway robbery. I mean, jumping the passing lane, snatching away your dribble, he'll take it from you. Rose. And again, it's the Knicks missing. And the foul on Kyle O'Quinn. That is his first foul of the game. Second team foul. Green kicks to Leonard. That misses had a chance to tie it there. He certainly didn't take advantage of the poor defense, but they can't count on him to continue missing. I tell you what, I think he'd be happy if he can continue to get looks like that. And he caps off the fast break with a monster slam. He is an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. You know, he picks the simple one-handed stuff to get the two points. Yeah, and in a close game, though, guys, those could be really important points. Now, Parker 
after the missed three by Carmelo. And it's blocked by Rhodes. Not sure if they're aware of the two-for-one opportunity. Well, they ought to be. I mean, that's basic basketball time management. You've got to be aware of your clock and your situation. Spurs trail by four. Green dishes to Aldridge. Back to Green. Kicks to Aldridge. And good work on the boards. They pick up the second chance points. I think they need to get much more disruptive defensively. They can't just keep allowing these easy baskets. That's got to be job number one right now. Nothing easy on the Get this inside. shit out of here, boy. And it's out of bounds to New York. They'll retain possession. And here's Anthony from the arc. Again, the miss by Anthony. And this quarter, he has clearly been off the mark. And Kawhi Leonard with the slam. Rising high to throw that one down. Sky high, fantastic one-hand jam. Nice, nice way there, guys, to finish up that possession. Good if it goes. No Hell no. There. Get the shit out, boy. Tie game in Senate. The third quarter now beginning. Both sides looking to pull Yo, away. Now it's time to take over, game. Don. You have to like what we're seeing from Carmelo Anthony. You, you know, we talk so often about making your teammates better and his ability to see the floor and then make those passes on time in that first half was the key. Boy, I tell you what, they say he's not a playmaker, but he certainly has fooled me with the way he's performing right now. And on the floor for Jeff Hornacek starting the second half. Porzingis is out there with Noah. Then there's Derek Rose. Then it's Lee. And it's Anthony in at the three slot. Now here's Rose. Takes the three. And Anthony with the basket on the assist by Rose. Rose has got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. He with the block. With the ball. He's picked up by Parker. Pass to Persingas. Lee outside. In to Noah. Six on the shot clock. And the shot is good. San Antonio trailing here. And Parker, here we go. And that one's good. And that's 11 points for Lamarcus Aldridge. You know, of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is major smash mouth basketball, guys. You're all about imposing your will offensively, idiot. getting exactly the kind of looks their coach drew up. And we're just about a minute and a half into the third quarter of basketball. Anthony against Leonard. Goes up with the stripe. Anthony can't hit. It's tipped. Stolen by Rhodes. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Yeah, how about the sharp steal and then run out? It looks like they're ready to put the hammer down. Well, we've been waiting for one of these teams, Greg, to pull away. Maybe that'll be a springboard for them. Could be. A dunk like that coming off a great defensive play has to build some momentum. Just a different look for New York. Lance Thomas, he's checked in for Pazinkas. Justin Holliday comes in for Courtney Lee. And it's Jennings in for Derrick Rhodes. Now Holliday following the three-point attempt by Tony Park. And he gets it to go. Some big points there. I mean, they got him on a nice play to get the ball right to the bucket. And exactly what they're looking for down the stretch, Park. Just more of the same. That's good. A little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the third. Anthony, the pass to Noah. Holiday with the three. San Antonio with the rebound. Parker's got his third rebound tonight. And Kawhi Leonard with the slam. Now, that was an incredible reverse throwdown right there. Tremendous body control. I'd even go as far as say, Clark, that was a punctuation gun. <laughs> huh? I can feel that. Sending a message. Yes, How about, sir? guys, that's that's one of those dunks that you probably want in your career. Highlight reel. 
And that's not the best of shot selection there. The defense definitely won that possession. Yeah, I think in that case, you've got to go elsewhere with the ball. You just can't rise up over the top of him when he's on you. Stolen by Thomas. Rebound, San Antonio. Yeah, that's what we call good defense in the paint. Worth its weight in gold. It absolutely is, and maybe even more than that. I mean, you saw it right there. Without his presence, that's an easy basket. There's been some slippage defensively here in the second half, Kevin. I mean, I'm not sure if their legs are going or what, but they've given up some easy baskets here. New York calls timeout. We have to like what we're seeing so far from Kawhi Leonard. We need to make some adjustments because he's absolutely scorching. A different look for New York, where Zingas comes in for Lance Thomas. And it's Lee in for Justin Holliday. And here's Anthony from the arc. The shot is off. Well, if this game comes down to the rebounding battle, they'll be the ones coming out on top. They've had a strong game on that front part, no doubt about it. The Spurs making a switch here. Aldridge has checked in. Double team on Rose. Anthony to Noah. It's deflected. Out of bounds. Next ball as New York keeps possession of it. As we close in on the start of the playoffs, let's see how the East is stacking up. Taking a look at Boston and checking out San Antonio. Tied right now. Now here's Anthony. 15 points in the game. He's been anything but his usual self this quarter. We know you're going to keep going to him, so we're just going to keep well, we doubling him up. The small you just revealed your game plan, bro. The league and generating the most deals per Since game. the get-go. And, and this is the set of guys that can do as much or more damage with their defense as they can with their offense. They know how to swoop in for a steal from anywhere on the floor. <laughs> 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 they to see where they're getting all their pilfers from. These are I don't like that. Players, though, who played Be 94 dick. feet of people. Now here's Parker. Still getting warmed up offensively. No buckets yet in the game for him. Rose with the ball. Now Green defending. Leonard with the steal. And a strong finish with two hands. And what's your take, guys, in the hustle sticks? Four San Eat a dick, bruh. They played with a lot of energy, and the steals we've seen are a result of that aggressiveness. Another factor here tonight has been the amount of points they've scored off turnover. Parker against Anthony. He feeds it to Rose. Rose double team. Back to Anthony. The pass to Persingas. No way, and that's a two. Go to the line for three free throws. No fucking way. That's bullshit, you piece of shit. You fucking dumb goddamn son of a motherfucking goddamn UAV jammer. And he hits the first of three. Fuck. Good on the second free throw. Fucking bullshit. And he nails the third. Well done again. He doesn't have the same problems at the line that plagues some of the NBA's other big men. Passes it to Bertens. Feeds to Aldridge. And that is good. Oh, I tell you what, nice little run here they're going on. And, and getting to the 10 has been the key. They're getting point blank looks. Time Hell time no. Again. Parker kicks to all. Back to Parker. Leads him in there. Here's Green. And it's good on the assist by Yeah, it's going to get out of hand now. Parker's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Pass to Persingas. Launches a three. Lamarcus Aldridge grabs the miss. Aldridge has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. And it's green missing just tentative in the paint lacking a little bit of confidence allowed to defender to recover and contest that shot you're not sure what that was about i mean talk about a brain cramp yeah <laughs> yeah completely a brain fade i don't know where that came from just lost sense of time and the situation stolen by rose 
Two on one as they jump out on the break. Jennings can't get it to go. Boy, I tell you what, guys, he's an extremely strong finisher. I'm surprised he wasn't able to power that through the defense. Some more fucking slam. The next tip shot a good percentage from the free throw line so far. They've made five out of six. And looking over their percentage on the season, I think they, they will be thrilled with the number in terms of their free throw percentage, 79. That's been one of the strongest aspects of this team this season. I mean, there have been very few off nights for them at the free throw line. From downtown. And the <laughs> Uncle Simmons. Buzzer, but it's off target. Come on, Uncle Simmons. quarter comes to... We welcome you back to what's been a hard-fought battle. Fourth quarter should be good. Knicks trail by four. Green teams with Leonard on the wings. Aldridge out there with Pau Gasol. And it's Parker in at the one. And that's who's in the game for the Spurs. Here's Lee outside. Lamarcus Aldridge grabs the miss. Aldridge has got rebound number seven for him tonight. Leonard dishes to Aldridge. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. Gasol's shot is good. Gasol's got the first basket as we get going in the fourth for the Spurs. Jennings passes to Carmelo from deep, and he gets it to go. And another thing about his game that's really noticeable is how well he handles defensive pressure when he's getting his shot off. He's a very composed shooter. Now here's Parker. Well, he had one three-pointer in the first half, but so far in the Fucking second, he's come up with two sets. Zinkis is checked in for New York. Knicks trail by three. Lee with the ball. He's picked up by Parker. Back to Lee. A few possessions into the fourth quarter, just over a minute played. Anthony kicks to Lee. And they're unable to get the time basket there. I wonder what the score would be if they weren't controlling the backboard. And Greg, it's clearly been their edge. And in a close game like this, you look for every edge you can find. Boy, I tell you what, he loves getting looks like that from the three-point line. No one near him. That's a warm-up jumper for him. Jennings get this shit up, boy. And so he draws the foul on the shot on trip to the line to shoot two. What a great game for Anthony in this one. He has 18 points, and he's buried a ton of three-pointers in this game, too. Uh, yeah, I think we need a calculator to keep track of just how many of those he's knocked down. The Knicks making a switch here. Boy, they came out of the locker room at halftime with a much more physical disposition than they had in the first half. And that helps, Clark. They've got extra trips to the foul line, and they need that to continue if they're going to get back in this game. Here's Lee. Ginobili kicks to Leonard. Lock at six. It's rebounded by New York. Persingas has got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And Holiday, here we go. Pass to Persingas. Stolen by Ginobili. And now here's Lee. The fast break opportunity. That falls nice feed that time for Milo Ginobili. Here's Lee. He passes to Persingas. Back to Lee. For the three. And yes, sir, that one drops. And you know, he's going to continue to bury those. If that's how they're going to beat him up. Launches it. No luck. So New York will take it the other way. To tie it up. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Spurs will take it. Derrick Rose is checked in for Justin Holliday. Spurs leading by three. There's the pass to Bertens. Kicks it out to Ginobili. Jacks up a three, but he stays with it. Bertens, the pass to Parker. Hands it from downtown. Parker's got six points in the quarter. He hasn't really done much on the offensive end, but he's worked within the team concept to help them get the lead. He's done some other things other than scoring to help his team get the lead here. Now here's Lee. Porzingis can't hit. Solid job by them on the glass here tonight. 
plus eight in rebounds. You know what, that rebound has always been a critical element of the game, and that's why they are now understanding how to win. Knicks trail by six. And we're about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter. Nothing too fancy, just simple execution. That's getting the job done when they need to make every possession count. Completely agree with that, Clark. They need stops and, and really can't afford any wasted possessions. Those inside shots are nice, high percentage looks. So it's San Antonio now. The Knicks making the shot. And Courtney Lee gets the whistle that time. First team. That is his first foul of the game. Lee kicks to Parker. Passes it to the Bears. Six to shoot. Parker. And there's the whistle. Foul yeah. hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. And with the offense getting right to the rim, at least they saved the layup. Right there, just telling them no easy layups. It's as simple as that. And that's what you expect from them. Marcus Aldridge just checked in for San Antonio. There you go. Let's close it out, boys. Regional. New York calls timeout. In the offense, I mean, they've been struggling. He just wants to get them back into a good flow and stop forcing shots. Well, Greg, the misses started piling up. Things kind of snowballed on them in that regard. This is a good timeout to kind of calm his guys down hit the reset button. It was a good fucking game, but this is win number 36. That's it, it's a wrap. Doris Burke has an update for us. Doris? Yes, Kevin, during that last break, I heard Jeff Hornacek as he addressed his team. No surprise, really. The turnover situation was the focus. He told him, listen, we're giving it away, guys. We've got to protect the ball, play within ourselves, and get quality shots. Kevin? Green dishes to Leonard. He kicks to Alder. Back to Leonard. From 15 feet away. And a great assist by Aldridge as that one goes in. The, the mid-range jumper is a high percentage shot for him. And when he's got that much room, forget it. Rose attacking. Bounces high off the rim and drops. Spurs leading by six. Here's Gasol. No play. And the powerful one-handed slam. Boy, he's got a little extra bounce in his step today, fellas. Ah, uh, definitely a surge of energy out of him there. Yeah, sometimes you forget just how athletic he can be. Here's Hernan Gomez. And stolen by Aldridge. Ah! <laughs> That's it. That's a confirm. <laughs> I guess he does have it in him, man, to get up off the ground when he needs to and rock it to the rim. <laughs> we love it. Compensates and makes up for it with his height. Gasol attacking Leonard. And the foul on Carmelo. Yeah, foul him up. That's his first foul. And New York. Yeah, foul him up. Checked in. San Antonio. We got the upper out. hand now, bruh. They're in front by seven. Nice try. There's a minute left in the fourth. That's right. That's a 36 game win streak. That's right. Can't be beat. 36 in a row. Yep, and you're going on YouTube tonight. Go ahead, let the time wind down. We're going to continue it and embarrass you. We got your user game tag. <laughs> Come on, let's embarrass him. Look. <coughs> Look at that. The difference is I'm winning. That's why I can do it. <laughs> He's embarrassed now. 
We're going to continue if you let the time wind out. I'm just telling you. You let the time wind out, and then we're going to continue and embarrass you, bro. Get on the mic. I don't give a fuck. We don't give a fuck what you got to say, because we don't give a fuck. <laughs> fuck them. That's all right. Let the time wind down. We're going to continue it, and then keep embarrassing you until you turn your PS3 off, and then you go to bed and keep your mom's couch warm. Because you definitely fucking rode the short bus with the shiny helmet and the chin strap and everything down the hillside of the hills. Yep, you did. Look. 20 points, 6 of 20 with Mello. Come on, you're just embarrassed, DeAndre Quata. <laughs> That's D E A N D R E Q U A T A H. That's his game tag. Jot it down, everybody. And make sure you add him up, sending a bunch of messages. Because they don't give a fuck. Look, Kawhi Leonard in LA killed you, bro. He's just embarrassed, and he's going to continue to let the time wind down. But that's cool with me, because we'll keep talking it up. So that's win number 36. There's a minute left in the fourth quarter. Gasol passes to Parker. Have a nice day. And the assist goes to Gasol. And the Spurs lead by nine. There's been a change in this game compared to what we saw. <laughs> Look. Yeah, look at that. Look. Look at them stats, bruh. It was close, but I had to pull out in the end. Sorry. You're terrible, bro. You're absolutely horrid. Go buy 2K Wrestling. He's <laughs> going with a lot of confidence now. Let's prolong this as long as we can until he quits. San Antonio calls timeout. They're up by nine. 52 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Yep, up by nine with a 36 game win streak and everything. Fuck them. Look, that's you. Look, that's you, Clarence. And it is flushed down with a nice jam. Didn't take their time in wrapping this game up. They <laughs> <laughs> nice ending spurt to polish it off. Once they had him on the rope, they started throwing haymakers at him. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Clary's Clary. Talk about a brain fade. Yeah. Fuck him. Yeah, completely a brain fade. I don't know where that came from. Just lost sense of time and the situation. Come on, quick, Clarence. That one falls, so he hits both of them. And San Antonio has possession. Outside green. By Lee, it's tipped. So they foul and uh, <laughs> now we're just toying with them. <laughs> we love it. So fuck them. And so he makes both from the line. Now here's Parker. This close to putting it away. Yeah, they don't need to do anything to reinvent the wheel here. I mean, just take time off the clock and squeeze the orange. Don't turn it over. Now, here's Parker. Pocket six. Green. Off 
target from outside. And so they choose to intentionally. <laughs> Drops the first one and that turns hey, out. Hey, 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 hey. Fuck him. Fuck him. Good on both. Gasol with it. It's Aldrich penetrating. And he paints. Look, you want to see you again? That's the face of a loser, bruh. In here, because if not, bruh. it's time to turn the lights out. <laughs> They're out already. I mean, give them a ton of credit for the job they did here today. Really impressive. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. They're down by seven. There's ten seconds left in the fourth quarter. Guys, your thoughts? And, and look, this one's out of reach. I don't know what they're thinking with this timeout. Neither do I. I mean, maybe they're going over their plans for after the game. Who knows? But well, let's just get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Leonard attacking. Oh, and that. Look, we're going to do the replay until we get little to no time. Look, we, you, we know your special ed, so you want to see it 20 times. One, no question, powered it down. Not surprised at all. He's shooting it well and scoring points in bunches. Have a nice and day. So it's San Antonio with the win. Even early on in this one, it seemed like they were happy to be playing at home tonight. Well, you know, it makes a big difference. I mean, you never felt like they had any doubt they'd come out. Like Kawhi Leonard and Porzingis know each other like that. <laughs> and the rest of our terrific crew. This is Kevin Harlan saying <laughs> thanks for watching. You, John. Now it's time for the Jordan player of the game, Kawhi Leonard. Kawhi the guy. Thirty-six game win streak, two K career high, continues with number forty. The online quick match. That was a tough game, but fuck that guy. He can go eat a bucket of dicks with Clary, Scalari, and Clarence. How you like that? That's what you get. That's right. Thirty-six in a row.